What's up, everybody? Jason here for JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. 2015 Immaculate Collegiate Multisport. One box break, random number block number four sold out. Ten total spots. Everybody gets a random number for the break. Zero through nine. And as an example, if you get block number three, we're going to go by the first number on the left-sided serial number dash, as it shows you right there, the examples of what it goes by. Again, any and all redemptions go to spot zero. Any one-on-ones go to spot one. And of course, if there is any non-numbered cards, which usually doesn't happen, but if there is, it'll be randomized between everybody. So here you go. Here's the dice roller. Here's the customer names and the numbers. Roll it. One and a three, four times. One, two, three, four. Chad down to Ryan. Four times. One, two, three, four. Three down to eight. <clears throat> All right, so Chad, you have three. Guy with two. Michael with nine. Michael Joseph. Michael L with nine. Michael Joseph, any one of ones. Uh, guy with five. Matt Barnhill with six, Eric with four, Gregory have any and all redemptions, Ryan H with seven, and Ryan P with eight. Now I'll keep the trade window open. I don't think people really trade R and B numbers, really. Cause you just never know. The only ones I think are most sought out for would be like zero and one. Of course one would be the most, but I'm sure Michael Joseph's not gonna trade one spot anyways. But I'll, I'll leave it open so you guys to see really quick and maybe there's something somebody chitter chatting about it. Let's close this, guys. <clears throat> All right, let's do this, guys. Same case. I would assume so, Justin. I don't think NT and Immaculate are so different in price. Maybe off by like a hundred bucks, fifty bucks, one hundred fifty, like anything under a couple hundred for sure. I think they're pretty much the same price point. I think with Immaculate though, no, I think NT still gives you this. Immaculate gives you like I don't even know how many cards this gives you. Like what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. NT usually gives you like ten. Right, I think NT gives you like 10. Oh no, actually NT only gives you like 6. 
About the same, I guess. I think it's off by like a couple hundred. Jason Witten, 76 out of 99. I guess technically this gives you eight cards, but two of them are base. So Immaculate gives you, oh, sorry, NT gives you six autos and memorabilia cards. And you probably get like a couple of base cards too. <clears throat> sorry, Jason Wynn's going to go to 76, uh, which is uh, Matt Barnhill. Cameron Artis Payne. Sixty one going to Michael Joseph. We have Matt Barnes, the pitcher Matt Barnes, not the basketball player Matt Barnes. Four out of ninety nine. Four is Eric. On card Kevin Newman for Arizona. Thirty six out of ninety nine. Six going to Matt Barnhill. Nike swoosh, Rashad Green. That is three out of five. Spot three. That's going to Chad Tucker. A little Nike swoosh for you. Very nice. Player worn material. It says. We got a Jaleel Okafor. For Duke. Two out of ninety nine. Two's going to guy. I was about to say, we haven't seen any like big rookie quarterbacks yet. I mean, Gary Grayson wasn't the biggest, but you still have a chance that maybe Mariota and Jameis Winston. 10 out of 99, Gary Grayson. But maybe the last box is hiding the big hit or something. Todd Gurley was pretty big back in the day, but usually... Kind of have big stars throughout a whole case, at least. That's going to go to zero. And Gregory, like I said. And last one here is an RPA of Terry Rozier. 13 out of 99. Spot three going to Chad Tucker. There you go. All right, boom. Not a bad box. Solid. Like I said, the last one's in the store, guys. If you guys want to run it back, jazpyscasebreaks.com. Thank you.